Hello everyone. Hello, professor. Um, in my video, I posted here some of the performance or the results that I got after designing um, an algorithm uh, trying to detect um, some uh, obstacles such as barrels and also uh, white and um, white lanes, um, left and right white lanes, to um, to uh, make a safety driving. Uh, we have uh, three different image sets, which are uh, trial course uh, image sets, which is uh, also test images E, A and B. Um, here in this project, the main challenge that I first faced is while I was working is that how to get an algorithm which works in completely three different image sets. For the first image, uh, which uh, called trial course set, we can see that uh, here we can see the bright colors, and we can see also the um, um, the left and white lanes, which are visible. Um, also, the barrels and ramps are visible. And by moving to the next image sets here we can see that this um, color is a has a darker uh, color and um, um, has a few barrels and the white lane is less visible than the first one by moving to the third image sets which is uh, test images B we can see that here we, we there are no barrels and also we can barely see the um, the left and white um, lanes. So uh, at first I tried to extract the RGB planes from um, uh, and convert it to grayscale and by working with many images individually I noticed that the blue plane has a bright lanes and ramp which make it visible for the vehicle to control its location. In addition the barrels are more visible, especially the orange and white ones. So, uh, here I displayed um, three examples of three um, different images after extracted the RGB planes and get the blue, blue, like uh, blue plus blue uh, plane to see how the white lanes and bar barrels are more visible now. So, uh, we can see here, we can notice here that this is the first image from the first um, uh, first image set and here the blue plane and here the blue blue plane for the second one we can see that the white white lane this is the blue plane and this is the blue blue plane we can notice that the right lanes are more visible now also the performance for um, the third image sets here, we can see that now the white lines are more visible. Also, in this report, um, after um, after extracting the the blue planes, uh, I tried to um, uh, reduce the filter, uh, reduce the noise, so by using the medium filter. But before that, here I posted in this. Um, in this report I uh, actually at first I thought that or I think um, I thought that the Laplacian of uh, Gaussian filtering will be a good uh, a good approach uh, to reduce the the noises however um, uh, it wasn't uh, a good uh, a good choice because um, we can see because in the different um, in the test images A and B, um, the edges were removed, and all, and here we can see the effects of the Laplacian of Gaussian filtering on the images. This is here we can see the edge detection. So the logarithm or uh, um, Laplacian of Gaussian filter is good for the first image sets while here for the second one we couldn't see the white lines and also here the um, 
the white lines are completely removed in the test images B. And actually the reason uh, behind that is because uh, the placing of Gaussian filtering are depends on the uh, uh, change in intensity levels. So uh, in the between um, the edges. So here we can see the intensity level is so low. This is why uh, the placing of Gaussian filtering couldn't uh, detect it. Finally, I posted here uh, in my report the summarize of my algorithm. Uh, here, for example, we can see that here is the original image. Here is the blue, blue image. Um, here is the medium filter. I used also adaptive thresholding and I used uh, an erosion morphological. After that, I used the Sobel erosion to detect the edges and I removed the fine details by a BW area open command. And after that, I, I used the uh, bounding boxes. So this is the first image. We can see the white lines and the barrels. And this is the result for this image. We can see that um, the algorithm could detect the left white line and part of uh, white lines and some parts of the barrels. Here also is an example that we can see the, uh, the white lanes and also um, the outputs for um, each step in, in the algorithm. Here we can see the white lanes and also here. And the result after the bounding boxes is that the algorithm could detect the white lanes just here, the um, some parts, but I think that uh, I consider this uh, this results as good results. Comparing to other bad performance in my point of view, for example, here we can see the white. Uh, this image is from uh, test images A. We can see the right white lines at the beginning, but at last. Um, the algorithm could barely detect the uh, right white lines, which is for me is a bad result because it could uh, make some danger for the vehicle while driving. Here, by moving to the poster, uh, actually the poster is summarized um, the main points which I used in my algorithm. Uh, for this project, the main goal, as I mentioned before, is to design an algorithm which can be good for three completely uh, different sets of images. And actually, that was uh, a challenge for me because each image is different from uh, the other one. Um, here, I posted uh, three different uh, examples. Here, we can see the brightly colored images. Uh, we can see uh, the white and left lanes and the barrels. Here, by moving to the test images A, we can see the darker uh, image than the first one with a few barrels and the illumination is very inconsistent. And by moving to the third test of images, we can see that this image is very poor, low contrast, and the lanes could barely seen and there are no barrels. Here is the flow chart of my algorithm that I used. Um, uh, we, we used um, RGB images and uh, made a loop to, um, to convert or to, uh, to read the images in each different image sets and then convert the uh, images into grayscale uh, after um, uh, after extracting the RGB images into grayscale. After that, I used the medium filter to reduce the noise. As I mentioned before, I um, tried to use the Laplacian of Gaussian, but it wasn't a good uh, idea uh, because um, spec uh, specifically for the second and the third images. 
um, after the filtering, I um, came to uh, image segmentation, uh, which image segmentation is a process of partitioning uh, the image into multiple segments to change the representation of an image into something that is more meaningful and easier to analyze. And the thresholding is one of the simplest uh, image segmentation. And I prefer to use the adaptive thresholding uh, more than general or glo global uh, thresholding because I think it's better to use um, multiple uh, thresholding values than just one. Here um, the, is the output of the adaptive thresholding for the first uh, image. We can see the lanes and barrels. Here also we can see the lanes and the barrels and also in the uh, test images B, we can see clearly the white lines. Um, after that, I use the morphological operation uh, in order to um, reduce these fine details, which is not necessary for me. So I use erosion um, uh, to reduce the fine details. I reduced erosion with the structure element um, uh, line. So I could um, um, erode or remove some of the uh, them, uh, some uh, some of the fine details. However, I can I noticed here that in the third um, uh, the third image set that some parts of the uh, the white lines were start to remove. Um, and I think the reason uh, behind that is that this lines are not uh, continuous lines and that was clear in the half transform and with um, edge detection by Sobel edge detection. Uh, some parts of the white lines were removed because they are um, non-continuous lines. After that um, I used um, um, bounding boxes to detect the, the last um, obstacles and lanes. Here is the um, bounding boxes results for the first image sets. We can see the white, right and left lanes and some parts of the barrels. Whereas here we can see the left lane for this image. The left lane is detected and just part of or small part of the right lane by moving to the third one third image. Also I can see that the left lane part of it was detected and just few parts of the right lanes. And actually this is um, this was the challenge for me is trying to um, to get uh, um, uh, as um, as much as um, uh, parts of the lanes or barrels that I can make. And this is um, uh, what I got and also I posted in my report uh, more than um, just one or two examples, many examples to, um, to the bad performance and good performance. Thank you.